Hello everybody! In this presentation we are going to explain how Prisma will progress in the following month. The overall project is divided in three main different areas that are development, marketing and communication. For each of them we identified the work packages that are the basic elements and the connection within them. As for the development, we are going to implement the communication between the FPGAs and to find a way to handle the complete database. Then, we are going to have a testing phase that will help us to understand if it works and what documentation are available. This way, we will try to further improve our work in a continuous switch between the implementation and the testing phase. As for the marketing, we are going to analyze the energy consumption that obviously is related to how we make the implementation. This means that a parameter of our test will surely be how much energy a specific implementation requires. Then, once we have the energy consumption analysis, we will move on to estimate the cost of each implementation. Running in parallel, there is the communication. We keep track of the development of our work on social media, for example Facebook, and with PowerPoint like this one and a written documentation. We identified four milestones of our project. First, the conclusion of the consumption analysis for the state of art is necessary to compare Prisma's implementation with the actual application. Then, the operating implementation of communication between FPGAs and the handling of the complete database are needed to complete our design. In the end, we would compare Prisma's consumption against the one of the state of art. The Gantt chart is a bar chart that helps us to show our project schedule. This way, it's easier to understand the planning of the work packages in the following weeks, with starting and finishing dates, and also highlighting when we expect to reach our milestones. This task organization is a direct consequence of both the difficulties we think we might meet for the development phase and the dependencies within the work packages. The SWOT analysis is a planning method that helps us specifying the objective of our project and identifying the internal and external factors that are favorable and unfavorable to achieve that objective. The acronym SWOT stands for Strengths, Weaknesses, Opportunities and Threats, that are the four elements analyzed. We have that Prisma's strengths include the improvement in the method energy efficiency and the fact that cores, data handle and application are already well defined or implemented. Instead, Prisma's weaknesses involve the reduction of the method throughput and the requirement of a connection between FPGAs that is not supported by default by Peta Linux, the operating system that we should use for our application. Prisma's opportunities are the very innovative application for an FPGA design and the less outlay compared to standard instruments, such as a computer with an i7 processor. Instead, Prisma threats are the fact that it is about a very specific step of the tandem mass spectrometry and it is needed an additional physical instrument that involves an initial outlay. That's all for now. Thanks for your attention.